goes, you're able to open up. I'm able to access two actual different sides at one time. So my storage people are able to get into like say ILB and ILD at the same time to work two different aisles. I can come through with a forklift. I can come through with a pallet jack. We can put up parts. Um, like I said, it saves space. It collapses in. It expands out. But also when you're talking about putting up parts and, um, and accessibility, when the day is done, the unit com collapses and everything is secure. I don't have to worry about um, access to either end of my warehouse. Everything's closed and it's secure on this end. What's unique about the touchpad system is that uh, you can control access, but you also can pull reports and find out who had last access to it. Um, I can I can set up each one of my um, my storage uh, NCOs or soldiers with a, a unique pin, so I can tell who's accessing at one point. But I can also control access so only people who actually have a pin have access to the system, which works really nice. Another piece that's interesting about it is it has some unique safety features. There's actually lasers that run from end, and there's another box like this on the other end, but there's also lasers that run from side to side. So the safety feature on this is that if you have a, a person that's physically in here working, the system won't move. It'll tell you physically on the keypads on either side that the aisle is in use. Also, if for some reason that there's an obstruction like a box or um, like a part that's fallen into the area, it'll, it'll, the lasers will pick up that as well. Um, they'll also pick up if there's any overlap that's um, breaking any part of the laser beam, they'll pick up as that there's someone or there's something in here as well. So in either one of those situations, the aisles don't move. So until you physically come down here, check where your lasers are and uh, physically check to make sure there's nothing obstructing, the aisles won't move. Um, scenarios where you actually have a physically a person that's obstructing or you have a, a part or a box um, sometimes it's even trash from putting parts away if there's anything physically in here between these two aisles you won't be able to, to close them until you cleared that out so it's, it's, a, it's a nice and it's a unique safety feature um, and it's worked well for us so far The award that we won was a Supply Excellence Award. We won for Forcecom. Um, the award consists of um, organization, supply, accountability, um, making sure that you're keeping up with your commander's property. They had to go through all of our records when they came in and make sure that everything was at standards, all equipment was off the floor. Um, by us having the shelving, honestly, I don't think we would have won the award because it was kind of hard to find a lot of things that you needed to make sure that you was at standard and by us having the cabinet we were able to have our absentee cabinets we were able to have um, all of our property that was supposed to be secured behind locked doors and keys so it worked out perfect it worked out real perfect and i can honestly say that <laughs> without the shelving we definitely wouldn't have we wouldn't have came as close as to what we came to now it worked out perfect